My name is David Lawrence. I am a portrait photographer in Orlando, Florida, and I focus primarily on creating portraits of individuals. Aside from that, I also specialize in instant portraits. So I set up studios in random public places where people can come and sit for a photo. And I use a 1960s land camera to capture an image. You manually pull the photo out of the camera. Um, you wait a couple minutes for it to develop and then you peel it open. And then uh, the subject has a professional quality uh, instant photo of themselves. One of the biggest things that I like about shooting film is the unpredictability of it. Whether you're shooting Polaroid film or uh, traditional 35 millimeter film, you never know exactly what you're going to get. Like you can have a rough idea, but there's been so many times where I've shot a Polaroid after shooting it that way a hundred times and suddenly I'll get a weird light streak or uh, the color will come out completely different than I've ever seen before. And it's the same thing with shooting 35 millimeter film. You go through your 24 or 36 exposures and you don't know what you're gonna get. And I've even had times where like I've shot a whole entire roll of film or so I thought and got it developed and there there was there was nothing. And then on the other side, just just that idea of, of loading film into your camera and even if you've done it hundreds of times before, knowing that each roll is going to come out a little bit different than the time before, knowing that most likely whatever it is, is going to be beautiful. Um, there's not going to be another image like it. With the rise of film, a lot of the film companies that are currently producing film today are large scale corporations. Fuji is a good example. Um, I, I use their film, um, have used it since like 2016. Um, it's an instant film for the land cameras. They were the only one that, that made it and uh, they just decided to completely stop making that film. So no one's no one's really made it in five years. Like everything that I use is just stuff that I found online. There's still lots of film companies that it seems like they're just killing film stocks overnight. Like even like Fuji announced again last week that like one of their main films that they use, like they're just stopping to produce it. You can take a film photo today and it will look like something that your parents or grandparents took 30, 40, 50 years ago. I feel like film is super nostalgic and like people love it. Like people are always like, oh, that looks like what I saw like when I was a kid or like my mom or my dad like had a similar camera. I went back and looked at an old family photo album that my grandmother gave me and there was an image that was taken on the same type of film that I use for my pop-ups. 50 something years later, I'm capturing memories of my own life and like taking portraits of, of people for their lives using the same film that my family used close to 60 years ago, which really blew my mind.